Ramadan is the month of sharing as such given to needy families attract a lot of blessings. As part of effort to reach out many families and individuals in this month of Ramadan, Direct Aid Society has distributed food items to individuals and families across Ghana for the simple reason to aid them in this spiritual journey, as many people may not afford to fend for themselves in the holy month of Ramadan. At one of the centers of Direct Aid Ghana, the Mercy Social Center, so many families come to receive their items. Beneficiaries of the gesture express their gratitude. These items that has been brought to us is really going to help us this Ramadan because some of us are really struggling. And Alhamdulillah, we are grateful to Direct Aid for giving us these um, iftar items. We are, it's going to help us during this Ramadan and after Ramadan. So may Allah richly bless you all and may He grant you abundant blessings and long life so as to continue this your good deeds. The condition of Ghana, we all know what is happening. And then there's a lot of pe uh, poor people in the area suffering and everything. So this thing is going to go a long way through this fasting. It's going to help a lot of people, a lot of people, myself included. It's going to help me very well because there are people that I sit with and I have uh, a lot of responsibilities to take care of. Allah bless them, uh, increase them, uh, give them everything they wished for. I want to use this opportunity to thank this noble organization for what they have done. I really do appreciate it a lot. May God bless them and answer all their halal prayers. Thank you very much. I do appreciate. Chiefs and opinion leaders were not left behind as they praised direct aid for their annual Ramadan distribution. It's very, very uh, impactful because people normally do distribution in Ramadan. But this one, I can see that it's unique. The passage is very good and it's recommendable. So the direct aid, what... Uh, they are doing is good uh, action that every Muslim should learn from them. Uh, because Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa as you know, when you feed somebody, even water, in a fasting period, Allah will give you a special water in Jannah. Let alone of giving the person a whole package of food that can take about two, even one month. If somebody is in need, or you are helping somebody who is in need, and we know the economic uh, uh, situation in the country, and you give somebody a food that can take about almost one month or two weeks or more, then it's, it's very commendable, it's very, very good gesture that we are praying to Allah to reward them accordingly. Because Allah, Allah said that they should do, and they have responded to the call of Allah, as Allah said. And this is go to the, uh, the other uh, ummah, that if you have the means, as Prophet said, you know, in the world we are not equal. That's why I said that God said in the Quran we should give sarakat to those who are in need. So those who have it, this is an example for them to learn from this direct aid that if you have it, don't be stingy. Try to expand yourself, your hand, to make sure that other people will be smile. Imagine people will smile because of you in this Ramadan. I've been working with Direct Aid for almost 10 years now. They are building schools, boreholes, hospitals, a lot of things that they are doing, including the uh, Ramadan feast, Ramadan uh, donations. Yeah, so they've been giving a lot of food to the Muslim community, especially even Muslims and Christians. Will be, they are not uh, discriminating. They give everybody that comes here. So that's why we thank Allah for this donation. And also we are praying to Almighty Allah to let the donors get more money and buy food for guardians. First of all, I want to acknowledge the rate aid for this gesture they've done for the people of Medina. This is not a novelty. They've been doing it. The rate aid, beyond this thing, they've done a lot. Just recently within my community, they came and developed a mechanized bowl for the community. So on behalf of my community, I want to say thank you to my brother and comrade, Sheikh Hamed, the director of Direct Aid. Direct Aid, a lot of intervention they're doing beyond building of schools, mosques, and this humanitarian discipline. They also engage in a lot of medical discipline, screening within our community, Medina. Anytime you see any medical screening, they do it. So we only pray that the government will look at them, and if there's any incentive, they will give them, they give them, because they are here to serve us, and we are also to respond to their service. Mr. Ali Abdesalam Ali is the head at the Mercy Social Center, explains the rationale behind the distribution and the resources that went into it. As usual, Director is, is continuously doing this uh, Ramadan distribution for the needy peoples, because like one of our mission to help the needy people, especially in this uh, Ramadan month. It was very nice and very wonderful because some of the people, they even can't find 
to break their fast. We have spent 2 million Ghana CD and uh, we distribute for more than 5,000 uh, beneficiaries in Ghana. So that one is including in North uh, Tamale and uh, Cape Coast, Komasi, which is Ashanti region, and uh, in Accra. And uh, Alhamdulillah, uh, we say thank you for donors, those who are on our beside to do such type of programs. Each person took home two 5 kg of rice, three liters of oil, and a mini bag of sugar, macaroni, tin tomatoes, among others. Houses TV, unique every day.